there so check it out there's the main code right there and i'm going to clear it see that all right so when i clear this okay so you erase on my computer and you can't even pull these up unless you're on a hand swell go scan so you erase race was successful check it out be patient what do you know she's gone and you also have the brake code also which is on so that's a pain in the butt but there you go right back when she comes so and then we we'll go up here to brakes and you have the brake codes for the abs so let's get coming back on too multiple issues lost communication with differential watch this though clear that clear that that'll go off now watch flash it shuts it off and the last should go off too <laughs> actually no it's not gonna let me take that one off this time i don't think but yeah it's a, you got computer problems going on here it could be because like i said the voltage regulator i'm gonna check right now <laughs> either way Go ahead and we'll go go here. <laughs> we'll go to all module scan. Okay, erase, erase all modules actually. How the heck am I gonna get out this car right? Duh! It's so hot. <laughs> Anyways, it's smoking hot to me. Huh? Try to get this guy to clear once more, but this is the, uh, the code right here. So, <laughs> yeah, well, I got what I need to get off of here. So, I'm going to do a full module scan one more time. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and get the hell up out of here. <laughs> Maybe a torque converter, I don't think so. More likely a bad computer on this car. <laughs> Definitely appears to be that way with the skid stuff and all that. <clears throat> That's a problem. So, let's see what's going on, my man. <laughs> Got it figured out in a way. I know what's happening. What's happening? I'm gonna come show you. <laughs> So I can actually, <laughs> I'm about to verify one second what it is. Ow. Checked all your fuses. You may have a bad computer. I'm going to show you right now. I can get the code to go away while I'm sitting in the car. My scan tool can power it off. It's losing communication with the starter. I'm going to look it up right now. It could be because of the um, uh, voltage regulator, but I don't think so. I think it's going to be a computer-related issue. I'm going to... Fortunately, that thing is like it is, I guess, for now, because there's no way to get this to go away. And here we go. We get the three electronic control module codes again. <laughs> right there is the one. Lost communication, so we're going to go ahead and erase this guy here. <laughs> erase engine control modules. Boom. They're going to power them off. And it's only doing it on the Volvo. <laughs> it's kind of cool. This dirt does work good sometimes. <laughs> Pressing on certain things. Yeah, they're all gone. Pretty much. No. I think that's because of the that's got a loose um let's turn it back on and off like I told you I did it. Yeah, so I think there's a loose um <laughs> a loose what's it called? I mean there I know there's a loose wire, sorry. So either way that's that one there. Right there we go. All the dinner. Get them all. Here we go. Race this one next. Here's another one here. Communication with the sub. It's a different code. 
Save yes, code. There's <laughs> a bunch of codes. I think it's a faulty computer on this fault. Unfortunately, that's what it's going to be. I believe so. I can't even get this one to go off. Let me try. It could actually turn it back and, and do it that way. It's the only way to clear these, I believe. I don't know what to do. Oh, I'll try one more time. <laughs> that one's a pro net. It won't let me even pull that one off of there, I don't think. <laughs> it could be because of the, uh, because the, <laughs> yeah, because that map says possibly. I don't think so. That's, that one's not going anywhere. This is just two miles away. Single missing. <laughs> yeah, there's codes everywhere. All right, that one's going to be going now, hopefully. That's <laughs> required with temperature sensor signal to the high signal. Let's get rid of all these codes. So here we go. Try to get this one powered off. It probably won't do it, but I might. Active. Active. Passing the department temperature sensor to the high. Active code there. <laughs> that was all of them, so. one last time see if we can power those guys all off it should take care of them hopefully everyone all right so this should be every code on here so that i can clear <laughs> when we get in them all we should work here we go let's throw it up I really like a shoe for a second until this thing kicks back on and recognizes the computer isn't working right. And that skid service went up earlier, I swear I did, but watch this battery light. But boom, I'm gonna pop right back on. A few more minutes this time. There you go. It didn't take long, did it? <laughs> but I can actually pull it up and clear it on here. That's the crazy part about this guy, so watch this right here. <laughs> Here, once you erase, <laughs> erase it. Once you erase the engine DTCs, it'll clear it. Once that clears that off of there, it's so crazy how that'll happen. I don't know why, but it's doing it just like that. There you go. Once it's erased, there goes the power management. Off she goes. <laughs> and that's that. So that's how that goes. And back when she comes, there you go. So, if you figured it out, it's definitely the U code. <laughs> Volvo Enhanced Scan. Here we go. One last time at this guy here. P01. Nah, uh, that's been on here. That's because of a, a messed up plug. <laughs> this is the one. PU12087. P120807. This is one. P. Oh, sorry. U012087. That's the one right here. It's causing all the problems. Boop, boop. All right. So, either way. One more time. Erase it. Erase. Off she goes. So, hey, computer is commanding it off. Now she goes right back on. Because there is a problem. The computer, more likely. I'm going to look it up right now. It could be the actual. <laughs> Voltage regulator strong. There she goes. So as you can see what I mean. Back on she is. But the alternator is checking out good. That's the freaking insane part. Let me check the alternator out real quick. Do a quick alternator test. You can see me checking it out. Alternator test. Here we go. Turn on the lights. Oh, damn. Well, you have the car with you? Yeah, I got it. Right. Got the car. Uh, all right. So look, I'm gonna show you real quick. <laughs> you got a second? I'll show you. So, damn. We do one more test. Turn the engine off. One more test. Yeah, it's really strange, but look, so I can actually uh, power it off myself, which is crazy. But I can make it, I figured out, I'm gonna look right here to figure out what it is. So look, um, damn it, sorry. So battery alternator test, alternator test, okay, continue. All right, move it up. Now, you see the power system? Now watch, put the lights on right, right here, they're on. The lights on, now watch this. So to the countdown, I want you to see something. <laughs> so 
So what'll happen is this. There's something going on with the computer, I believe, or it's the voltage regulator, one of the two. I checked all your fuses, all your wires in the back. They're all good. I checked them all the way back. Your back one is up here on the side. So when this counts down is over, I'm gonna show you. So you're charging. Problem is, I think your computer's going bad. Let me show you. See, the alternator is checking out good, so <laughs> it's really crazy. Now, watch this, okay? So, when I go into Volvo, right, <coughs> I'll do an enhanced scan, you see? Enhanced scan. Now, watch this. That's because of the loose plug, right? That one. Loose plug. This one, <laughs> loose plug too, more than likely. This code right here, you see that one? This code right here. Ready? Lost communication was started. Permanent code. Generator, which is your alternator, control module, missing message bus signal message failure. Probably voltage regulator. I'm going to double check this code in one second. But check this out. See the battery light? Watch this. See the battery light on the dash? Watch it. I'm going to clear it, okay? Watch on the dash. <coughs> you watching? Watch. I'm going to erase it right now. Erase it. Give it about 30 seconds. So but all the lights will go off. Watch this. The power system light will go off. So with the battery for about 10 seconds. Then it comes right back on. See it? And wait is for it, it'll kick it right back on here in a second. See? I've done it like 15 times now trying to figure out what's going on. So I'm gonna look that code up, but I'm pretty sure you got it. It's either a computer issue or a bad voltage regulator. But it's, the good news is, if there's any good news you wanna take out of it, is it is not the, uh, I checked all the wires, the wires are good. I just don't wanna start